Hey everyone. Happy Friday again from the cabana. Oh, you hear the sound of the waves and the tide pool. It's a lovely weekend. Although, although, it's been a pretty bad week. You got it. Okay, before I get into that, let me remind everyone, uh, on the bright side, we got us a party next Saturday. Not, not tomorrow. Don't come tomorrow. I'm helping a friend move and stuff. No, uh, Saturday the 27th. Gonna have some, some good food, some good drinks, good friends, good singing, good music, and some hula girls giving us lessons. Yeah. The 27th, 6 o'clock till, you know, the police tell us to stop. But now, back to crappy cabana time. This week has just been really bad. I mean, these people are just making us a national disgrace. An international disgrace, right? Their lies and, and just, you know, trying to act... Oh, no, 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 I'm not talking, I'm not talking about the politicians. No, I'm talking about those swimmers. Yeah, down there in Rio? Oh my word. Why do you make up a stupid story like that? Being held up at gunpoint when all you did was break a, down a restroom door trying to go pee, right? That's, that's not that embarrassing to make up some elaborate story. So, but you know, what can you expect? They're swimmers, not very smart. I should know, I was a swimmer. I was on the swim team in high school and uh, until I got smart, and quit. Yeah, because it's just back and forth and back and forth and back and forth. Come to think of it, it wasn't that I got smart. It was the ADD kicking in. I can't do that. Just uh, no, no, I need something to chase or I don't know. Anyhow, not not too bright making up a story like that. So here's a little here's a little PSA for you kids out there. If you do something embarrassing, something stupid, right? Don't make up some big elaborate story that people can check up on rather easily, right? Gotta use your wits. Say something like, I had too much to drink, broke down a bathroom door trying to go pee. Most people aren't gonna look into that one. You know, that's just not that exciting of a, of a story. Which makes me think, there's more to this than that. You know that, don't you? Yeah, you know it. Because, okay, first of all, they didn't have to go pee. Right? Because, hello, they're swimmers. They always pee in the pool. Yeah. I, I mean, you do, right? I do. I know that. So, okay, another another little PSA for you kids out there. I really don't recommend uh, swimming in public pools. It's, uh, it's basically, I hate to say this, it's not water. It's not. It's just urine and bleach. And that's about it. I, I don't recommend it. So, that is not, they weren't going to the bathroom. There's something else going on, you know, and, and that reminds me, if you do come to my party uh, next Saturday, the 27th, don't pee in my pool, all right? My tide pool over here. It's not good. First of all, you, you can't sneak that one. I mean, you're standing out there. We're going to see a bit more than just a smile of relief on your face. No. Um, and don't, don't kick down the bathroom door. If it's locked, somebody's in there. Hello? Which... Which brings me right back to these guys. Yeah, so why do you kick down the door? I did a little research on the internet. Yeah, um, just happened to find out that, um, that turns out uh, prostitution is legal in Rio. And uh, I wasn't looking up that or anything. No, I was just looking up uh, Rio facts and figures. figures. And, and besides, uh, I knew this because my sister used to live there. I'm, no, I'm not saying that no, she, she's, she's good. She's got an accent, all right? She's sophisticated. No, no. My point is, my point is, I think it was something like that. Because, because I think what happened was, is that, you know, they're, they're with these girls that they meet, and, and one of them says, I gotta go to the bathroom. So they stop. And then she goes into the men's room. Because there's something else I found out about Rio. Yeah! And I think he flipped out and kicked down that door to see if she was standing or sitting. And I think she was standing. I think that's why they... Why else would you make up a story of someone having a gun to your head? He probably... Okay. I think I've gone too far. So, I... There's more that's going to come out about this. And they, they're not going to be happy about that. So, the lesson, boys and girls, is first of all, just don't, don't do something stupid. 
And second of all, when you do, don't make up a really elaborate, stupid story. Just fess up, you know? The dumbest thing I want to see you do that you might not want to fess up to is show up here in the cabana. It's next Saturday, not tomorrow, not tomorrow, the 27th, 6 till whenever the police tell us to stop. You'll have a blast. I'll have a blast. We'll have a good time. And uh, meanwhile, I wish you all a very happy Friday. Cheers, everyone. Thank <laughs> you.